Hey everyone and welcome to the Web Talks Gear Review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Black Diamond Trail Trek walking poles. These walking poles are pretty awesome. So let's take a look at the key features. So first off, it features the flat lock technology. So rather than having to twist the walking pole or anything like that, you've got this locking hinge system. And basically what that does, you can adjust it, push that down, and that locks the actual adjustment pole in place, which is really, really cool. Talking about the overall length of the pole itself, it, the length is 64 to 140 centimeters, so you do get a great variancy to it. And the overall weight is 460 grams per pair, which really isn't that much. On the bottom, you get your traditional kind of, your traditional ender, should we say, but what you also get with the uh, the um, the walking poles themselves is these adjustment systems. So you've got a pretty standard adjuster on the base there. So what that means is that's going to stop if you're walking on uh, wet out or kind of damp conditions or wet ground. That's going to stop that from obviously piercing through the the mud itself. But if you are walking, say, on snow or something, all you need to do is unscrew this. It does take some time but you kind of want it to take some time. So you just unscrew this nice and easy. That comes off. And then you've got your wider footbed. You screw that on. And there we go. So basically now, due to this wider head, it's gonna actually prevent your uh, pole from going in any deeper. So if you are, say, going through snowy conditions or it really is a bog, and this little one here isn't gonna do much justice when it comes to actually stopping the walking pole to go straight through, you get these adjustments on here, that footbed there, just a wider preference, and then, hey, presto, you're basically good to go. And all that does is just a little screw system in place there. So let me just do that up to put that back on there so yeah with the flat lock technology it's really easy to open and undo you've got one there and you've got one there and let me just open that on there traditionally as well you do have your safeguards so uh, i'm just trying to get that shot in the close up there for you so you do have measurements on the side there so you can adjust it accordingly so you can marry up the two so then they're the same height throughout the word go, or again, if you if you earmark it on the same high, height when it comes to storage, when you put them away, you close it up, and at least then when it comes to you hitting the trails again, you close that up, you know that, uh, yeah, you kind of know the size that you're gonna go to. So you just go to that line, lock it in place, and then hey presto. What's also really nice is the soft grip at the top there. So you've got your traditional handle when it comes to the walking uh, pole itself. Uh, great variancy, obviously you've got a loop system as well. So you feed that through, and then you can hold that in place like that, depending on obviously how you do it. Yeah, you know, it's, and again, that's nice and soft and comfortable. But grip wise, you've got a nice soft grip around the main handle, but you also have soft grip at the base as well. So if you are stretching or overreaching, not that you should be, but if you are in an awkward position where you can't grab hold of that, and you just need some additional grip, you've got that at the base there, which is fantastic. Yeah, so just, as I say, when it comes to holding it and positioning the walking pole itself, you've got more flexibility. Uh, so. Who are these walking poles, walking poles for? Well, to be fair, you can use them for your everyday hiking, you know, doesn't, you know, a walking pole is a walking pole. But if you are climbing, if you are trekking in wetter climates, in colder climates, in snowier climates, the fact that you get these adjustment points for the base is a no brainer. So yeah, if you are looking at going, you know, to colder, wetter climates where there's boggy terrain, snowy terrain, this is definitely something to consider. But again, if you're just gonna be doing some, uh, you know, walking in hotter climates during the summertime, you know, or, you know, the conditions that you walk in are gonna be nice and dry, these are gonna be perfect for that as well. So they really are an all-rounder. Anyway, if you want any more information on the Trail Trek, I believe as they're called, just head over to our website, webtalks.com, or click on the link that is pinned in the comments below. And whilst you're there, you'll notice that we're doing something really cool, a really cool initiative, which is called Place an Order, Plant a Tree. So when you place an order through our website, webtalks.com, we are gonna plant a tree. And that is amazing, because this world needs more trees which i think within itself is fantastic but also 
And what a lot of people don't realize is how eco-friendly our warehouse is. So as of recording, we have got our carbon emissions down by 93.5%, which within itself is fantastic. So, you know, very eco-friendly warehouse, good for the environment. In fact, it's one of the most eco-friendly warehouses in Europe. Do you know what? even of the world. But when you combine the place and order plant to tree initiative with our very eco-friendly warehouse, it does something rather special. So that one tree we are going to place based on your order with us basically means it actually wipes out the carbon emissions of three other web talk orders. And the only reason why we can do that is because our carbon emissions are so low. Again, 93.5% as of recording. And of course, if those, you know, those three other web talk orders are also going to be planting trees as well. So it's a massive benefit to the world and to the environment, which is something that we're super excited about. Anyway, if you want to find out more about that, the Planted Tree Initiative and our eco-friendly warehouse, I've pinned them in the comments below as well. So check those out. Anyway, I'm going to stop interrupting your day now. So uh, I hope you have a good rest of the day, whatever time you're watching this. So thanks for watching and happy trails.